everyone, it's Dan Can, Daniel Hunt, the People's Realtor. Welcome to the channel. If you enjoy watching home tours, I would like to invite you to join my YouTube family by subscribing. So today, I am here in Prosper, Texas with a gorgeous Perry home to show you. The home you're going to view today has five bedrooms, five baths, right under 3,800 square feet on a 70 foot lot at a start price of 815,000. The home you're gonna see today is around 950,000, has some amazing upgrades. I can't wait for you to see it. If you're interested in purchasing anywhere in the Dallas Fort Worth Metroplex, be sure to contact us with the number below. Text Perry to the number below, okay? Can't wait for you guys to see the home. Get your popcorn ready. Let's go. So right when you come into the home, you're greeted with eight foot wood and glass accented double doors. To my right, you have this gorgeous dining area. As you can see, it is placed for six. You may get eight here comfortably. I think anything more than that would overpower the space. Loving the brass accented light fixture. And I'm loving the, the uh, wallpaper they chose for. The, uh, the back wall here, I'm a big fan of textured wallpaper, so I think that just looks gorgeous. This home does have surround sound speakers throughout the whole entire home, which I think is perfect uh, when you're having a, an elegant or nice or even romantic or even family dinner. You can set the mood with your music here and plenty of uh, windows let in a lot of natural light, okay? Straight across, you guys know I'm always saying I spend a lot of time <laughs> In my office, you have eight foot French doors. And I think this is the perfect size office. I mean, I, I'm, I'm also a fan of a real big office, but I think this is perfect size office. If you wanted to put a TV there in the corner, you can. You can watch your stocks and things of that nature. I mean, this is the perfect size desk. I definitely see me getting a lot of work done in this office. Now let's go check out three of the five bedrooms upstairs. But before we go upstairs, I want to point out right when you come into your home, you're also greeted with 22 foot ceilings with plenty enough recessed lighting. I'm also loving the cathedral style, but still modern light fixture right as you go up your uh, wood and right iron staircase. Let's go upstairs. So here we are upstairs. Always love being able to look down at the family room and the kitchen and dining area. Just makes the whole upstairs feel a whole lot airier. To my left is our first bedroom. Before we go into the bedroom, we're greeted with a bathroom. This is a Jack and Jill bathroom with quartz countertops, chrome fixtures, and a decent sized walk-in closet. Okay. And here we have our bedroom. Now this is a queen size bed, okay? You do have two full dressers, so just to give you an idea of the space, you can get a king in here comfortably, still have enough uh, space, like I said, to put, uh, your dressers may be a little bit smaller, but still more than enough space to do that. Plenty of uh, sunlight. You have your modern, very contemporary ceiling fan. Perfect bedroom for kid or guest.
And to my right, you have your bathroom. Like this was a Jack and Jill bathroom, quartz countertops, chrome fixtures, stand alone tub with shower, chrome fixtures, and subway design tile for the shower. Okay. Right across from there, you have a very large closet, linen closet, and I think that would be perfect for a coat closet. Now this bedroom is a little bit smaller than the one we just left. However, you have two full-size beds, so you can get a queen in here comfortably with two full-size dressers. And one thing I love about Perry Homes, I mean, they all have really good walk-in closets. So more enough space if you have guests or like kids or uh, if you want to you know, store their toys in there, more enough space to do that. More closet space, guys. Perfect linen closet. Now this is the largest bedroom of the three on the second level, okay? This is a queen size bed. You can get a king in here comfortably with two full dressers, okay? Plenty of light. Uh, one thing about this floor plan, I love about this floor plan is each room, each area of the home has plenty of natural light. If you guys have watched any of my tours, you know I'm a big fan of natural light. And this is the largest walk-in closet of the three bedrooms. And I mean, they all were large, but this is really nice size. Plenty of space for storage and clothes. And just very elegant, sleek bathroom. Again, coarse countertops, chrome fixtures. Loving this design style tile. Chrome fixtures for the shower as well. So now, guys, let's go to the entertainment area. Here we have our space here, which is perfect for, as you can see, they have a pool table here, poker table, sports game room, or what a lot of people are doing now, they're homeschooling their kids. This is the perfect space for a homeschool uh, area. And one of my favorite areas of the home is this media room, right? If you've watched any of my videos, you know, I love movie rooms, especially when they're done right. Um, excuse the openings here in the wall. They're changing the sconces, so they are doing a little bit of repairs on the home. And you guys are probably one of the first to see this model home. Uh, nice side, you probably can get, I would say easy, 12 people in here comfortably. You have more in the space here for 100 inch screen. You have a seven speaker system here. So, I mean, I'm, I'm assuming, I'm, I can probably bet it's gonna sound amazing here once it's all hooked up. Let me know what you guys think of the home so far, all right? Let me know what you think. I love interacting with you guys. Comment, like, subscribe. Let me know what you think of the home so far. Now, let's go downstairs to look at the main living area and the primary bedroom. So here we are downstairs, right before we enter our main living area. We're greeted with a half bath here with quartz countertops. What do you think about this living area, guys? Let me know in the comments. Could you see yourself entertaining here? Plenty of space for a uh, 75 inch television set if you wanted to put it here or over your mantle. My favorite focal point of this living area is this gas fireplace. You have an oversized gas fireplace with this gorgeous stone tile flowing all the way up to the ceiling. 22 foot ceilings, plenty of uh, recessed lighting. And I'm always a fan of sliding doors so you get that indoor, outdoor concept feel. Great for entertaining, especially on sports days, sports evenings. You'd have people outside grilling, sitting, enjoying outside, and also be able to interact with your company on the inside of your living room. Dining area, I think this is perfect for four to six people. Anything more than that, I think would be overpowering this space. And what about this kitchen, guys? Let me know what you think about this kitchen. This is a quartz site. I love this countertop. I'm really a big fan of this design. Here we have brass fixtures with a huge farm sink. 
six burner cafe stove with vent hood. You have your brass accented cabinetry with your glass accents. Oversized refrigerator. And here we have kind of a butler's pantry area, which is perfect for, I think, uh, uh, getting your meals together. Maybe if you want to also put a wine cellar here or a wine cooler, it would be a perfect space for that because you have your dining area right next to it, okay? Here we have our laundry room, okay? Plenty of space uh, to put a sink in here if you wanted to as well. Mudroom area with another closet and this would be your entry into your home from your three car garage, okay? And I'm just loving the light fixture that they chose for this kitchen. Again, guys, love interacting with you all. Let me know what you think about this living area. I mean, I'm just loving the, the materials that they chose to design this kitchen. Big fan of that. Before we go into our fourth bedroom, you have a closet there. Nice size bedroom. This is a queen bed. You can get a king in here comfortably with two full dressers, okay? Plenty of natural light. Loving the uh, uh, almost floor to ceiling windows in this bedroom. And I think it's a very elegant bathroom, guys. Quartz countertops. You have your designed uh, tile for the floor, slate tile for the shower and really nice size walk-in closet. Now let's go check out the primary bedroom. So here we are in the primary bedroom. Guys, so much talk about this room, probably my favorite feature in this room is this textured wallpaper. I think it just brings a really elegant look to this room. Oversized king bed with two full dressers. You can see the amount of space that you have on the side of dressers, just to give you an idea of how large this room is. They have, I think this gorgeous dresser here, which if you want to put a TV here, you could get, I mean, you can get as, as big as a 75 inch television set here. A very modern light fixture. I mean, this is just a perfect size primary bedroom. Now, one thing I love about this bedroom is if you wanted to put sliding doors or a door here uh, where your windows are at, you can do that. Just in case if you install the pool, you can have easy access to your pool area. What do you think about this primary bathroom, guys? Really nice size. You have dual sinks. I like the, the fact that they're kind of separated. That way, you won't get in each other's way. Quartz countertops for both vanities with brass fixtures. Here we have our water room. Nice size shower, subway tile with slate flooring in the bathroom and also in your shower. And I can definitely tell that the tub should pass the Dan Can test, but let's check it out just to be sure. Again, like I always say, I'm 6'1". Let's see if I can, oh yeah, pretty, it's, it's a lot deeper than um, I thought, but really nice size uh, soaking tub. Another feature I love about this bathroom area is you have his and her closet, so you have separate closets. So in case one person's nearer than the other, <laughs> you don't have to worry about that because you have your own closet. I will say that was maybe a tad bit bigger, but really nice size closets, okay? Now let's go outside to check out the entertainment area in the backyard. So here we are outside, back patio. Loving the size of this patio. You can see they have perfect for uh, eight here. I think you get probably even 10 here comfortably. You could put either TV on that wall or that wall. Plenty of space to put a grill on that wall. There is a couple electric outlets there. And if you also wanted to put 
a gas grill. You can put a gas grill there. There is a gas light on that end as well. Now this home is on a 75 foot lot, okay? In this area, Proper Texas, Perry Home also has 50, 55 foot lots available as well. Those are starting more at the 600, high 500 to $600,000 price point. Like I said before, these are starting about 815,000, can go up to about anywhere between 1.2 to maybe 1.3, depending on the upgrades, okay? This size of a lot, you can see it would be perfect size if you wanted to put a small pool here. If you want to extend your uh, outdoor living space, you can do that as well. So let's talk a little bit about this location. Again, here we are in Prosper, Texas, minutes away from PGA Tour, 10 to 15 minutes away from the Star and Legacy West, where you have plenty of spaces, places to eat, shop, get entertainment. I mean, this area is just really booming, growing very fast. They had about um, a little over 100 lots available three months ago. And for the 75 foot lots, they have about only 20 lots available. So they're selling fast. They pre-sold very, very fast. So if you're interested in purchasing a home, here in Prosper, Texas, one of Perry Homes, or anywhere in the Dallas Metroplex, be sure to text Perry to the number below. Follow me on Instagram at It's Dan Can. Again, comment what you love about the house, right? Comment, subscribe. I love interacting with you all. Thank you guys for tuning in. Health, peace, and prosperity to you all. And I'll see you guys on the next tour. Bye-bye.